Good morning everyone and welcome to another video on Mr. Ong Math Lesson. Today, I'm going to show you 5 amazing math tricks involving multiplication and division which I found on the internet and I want to share with all of you. So let's go. So the first one, there are 5 in total. So the first one looks like that, okay? So the first one is called the same 3 digit number. Okay, so now you are going to think of any 3 digit number, okay? where all the digits are the same. For example, 111, 444, 777, or 999. Got it? Great. Now the next step we're going to do, you're going to add the number. So for example, if we take 777, you're going to add the three digits. So 7 plus 7 plus 7, that is going to give you 21. And the last step, you take that number 777 divided by 21, which is you add the three numbers. And then your final answer is going to be 37. Okay, you divide the three-digit number by the answer in step two. Same thing, if you use 999, and then you take 999 divide by 9 plus 9 plus 9. So 999 divided by 27, you will also get 37. So no matter what number you choose, the same three-digit number, if you divide by the addition of that, you will get 37. Amazing, isn't it? Great. Now, trick number two, okay? Trick number two, six digits becomes three. So what it means that you are going to take any three digit number. You can take four three one and you double it. So four three one four three one. It could be one two three one two three. So we shall work on four three one four three one. Okay. So next step, divide by number by seven. Take that number, divide by seven. When you get the answer, you divide that answer by eleven, and then you divide again by thirteen, and your answer is going to be four three one. Okay, don't believe me? Try any three digit number, double it, and divide by 7, 11, 13. It could be in any order, you will get the same three digit number. Awesome, isn't it? Great. Now, trick number two, three. Okay, trick number three coming up. Trick number three. Okay, your answer will always contain the digit 1, 2, 4, 5, 7, 8. Okay, so ready to go? Let's go. So, you are going to select any number from 1 to 6. It could be 1, it could be 5, it could be 6, it could be 4, it could be any number. Okay? Done it? Okay. Put down a piece of paper, bring your calculator out. You're going to multiply that number by 9. Okay? Now, once you have done that, multiply the result by 1, 1, 1. Got it so far? Okay? Take your time. Once you got the result, when you put the equal sign, you're going to multiply one more time by 1001. So far, so good? Great. And the last but not least, you're going to divide by 7. Okay? Put in your answer, and your answer will contain this following number 1, 2, 4, 5, 7, and 8. It could be in any order. If I use 5, the number came out to 714285. So it can have 1, 2, 4, 5, 7, 8. So try any number from 1 to 6 and see whether it works. And that is the amazing trick number 3. Okay. Now we're looking at amazing trick number 4. Okay. Now it's called recurring magic number. Okay. So write down the following 8 digit number on a piece of paper. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. You miss the 8 and the 9. Okay. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 and a 9. Okay. Okay, once you've done it, circle any of the numbers. It could be 4, it could be 7, it could be 9, it could be anything. So far, so good? Okay, choose one number. Have you done it? Great. Now, what you're going to do, you are going to multiply that number by 9. So, if you choose 6, 6 by 9. So far, so good? Okay. So, now, once you have the answer, you are going to multiply that number again by the first number. Okay? So, once you got that total, you multiply by that number. Okay? And your answer will be the recurring number of the number chosen in step B. So if you choose 5, your answer is going to be 5, 5, 5, 5, 5, 9 times. Amazing, isn't it? So that is trick number 4. And last but not least, we are going to look at trick number 5. This is a very simple trick, okay? So if you want to know someone's age, ask them to key in their age in their calculator. Got it so far? Okay, then you ask them to multiply by 13,837. Okay, then the last step, multiply again by 73. And your friend's age will appear 
recurring four times. It is 53, it's 55, 3, 5, 3, 5, 3, 5, 3. If it is 14, it's 14, 14, 14, 14, and it will occur four times. And that is amazing trick number five. Amazing so far, isn't it? Great. Last but not least, we have a bonus. Okay, this is not multiplication, but sometimes you want to know the seven digit of pi. Uh, another video I've done how to memorize 40 digits, but in this video, if you want to remember the seven digit of pi, here it goes. Okay, so remember the word how I wish I could calculate pi. The number of letters in the word will represent the number of pi. So, how is three, i is one wish is four and so forth so how i wish i could calculate pi that will give you the total so 3.141592 so that is amazing trick number six the bonus trick so hopefully you have enjoyed this video share with it and don't forget to subscribe to this channel and see you everyone cheers have a good day